Behind me is a fish farm that has been abandoned for years. And it was once home to thousands of different fish. But even though it's been abandoned for years, there's still fish living in here. And our goal today is to save every last one of them. What could be living in these abandoned fish farm ponds? Well, we're about to find out. But first, let me explain to you where we are. Today I'm here with my friend Josh, the owner of Summerland Fish Farms. What's going on everybody? Now Summerland Fish Farms is one of my favorite spots in the whole world, okay? This place is insane, it's massive, there's fish everywhere. Everywhere you look there's just fish. But today guys, our video here is going to be a little bit different and that is because my friend Josh called me the other day and he said, listen, okay, I've never told anyone this before. No one knows about it, but in the back of the fish farm is a bunch of ponds that have been abandoned for years now. And Josh here wants to renovate them, get them going again. But in order to do that, we need to get in here and catch all the fish that are still in here and get them out. I mean, dude, this is going to be insane. There could be anything in these ponds. Do you even there, know? No, I don't even know. I know what I put in one pond. That's what we're going to check out today. You went and drained a pond that you thought had the most fish and that's what we're we're gonna be focusing on today yeah. you think there's like a bunch in there right I think it's gonna be a bunch of koi maybe some cichlids i i don't know man it's Dude. gonna we're gonna see this is insane guys i'm super excited let's get started and let's see what all we could save so behind this fence josh is the abandoned part this is where the ponds are correct this was an area for breeding fish the hurricane knocked down the nets i don't put fish back here because then i gotta battle the raccoons and all the herrings and all the different stuff that'll just eat the fish anyways this is not a production i do use it for stuff like what we are doing today i've been draining the pond all morning we'll see what we got in there how many ponds are in total like how many ponds are back here there's eight on this side and there's six on the opposite side that is a lot of ponds okay so to simplify it to keep it simple obviously we can't save fish out of every single one so no. josh went ahead and he drained one of them that you think has the most fish and that's the one we're going to focus on we might place some fish traps net around some other ones but we'll keep it simple we'll start with one and we'll see what we can save guys here we go it says I mean, it says do not enter are we sure about this We'll be okay, here we go. It's like Jurassic Park. I'm excited. Wow. Okay, so, dude, these ponds are huge. There could be a lot of fish in here, Josh. Oh, this is going to be a big job. Wow. So where's the one that you've drained? Is that... Right over here. Oh, I see it. Okay. Oh, dude, I see fish down there. What are those? Oh my gosh, they look like African cichlids. Okay, maybe we'll place some fish traps in there. There while has we... to be something in each one. This is insane, dude. These ponds are huge. Okay, so this is the pond. Okay, this is the money maker right here. This should have a lot of fish, correct, Josh? There should be a good amount dude, of Dude, this I'm is excited. insane. Look down there. There's some big fish, bro. Oh, there's so many koi. This is insane. Dude, there could be thousands of fish in here. What are we we just got to get some nets, start scooping. All right, let's do it, guys. You ready, Josh? I am so dude, ready. Look okay. how many fish are down there so you put in bigger koi and you think they had babies oh no for sure they had babies i didn't put nothing in that small you first oh, me first you first oh man oh bro there's fish in the mud like the slime right here all right okay i'll come this way so we're gonna tag team this i'm gonna go this way he's gonna go this way we're gonna hopefully trap him in oh look at this bro i'm ready, ready? Oh. oh, what the heck are these? Whoa, Josh, I think these are African cichlids, bro. Oh, you got some koi, our gotta, first net. We gotta find the male, man, so I can figure out what they are. You can't tell which they are because they're so tiny, but that means there's gotta be big ones too. Oh, for sure. All right, so there goes the cichlids. We're separating them. Cichlids in here, koi in here. You got two koi. We got two. Wow. Oh, this one's a, a nice butterfly. Long. This is literally insane right here. Oh my gosh, I found the male. Look at the colors on that one. It's like really electric blue, bro. Josh, there is thousands of fish. Look at this one. Oh, try to get that one. Oh, oh my God. This is insane. That's definitely one that started the breeding process in here. So this sure. one's the one that had babies. All right, there goes a bigger koi. This is so crazy. Probably were a lot more koi in here, but the cichlids ate all the eggs. So. Yeah, this is actually insane, guys. There's probably thousands of fish in here. We really got to try to catch all of them. I don't know how we're going to do it, honestly. This is kind of impossible. And there's like eight more of these ponds, but look at that cichlid. Oh, you got one. I got one. <laughs> you see what the scales look like that? They call those German scales. Dude, giant Look scales. at that. That's wow. going to be beautiful when it gets bigger. Add it to the bucket. Right here, Josh. Right here. Oh, we got them all trapped. Oh! Oh, my God. I got algae. <laughs> I don't think I caught anything. Josh. Oh, my God. That's a Taiwan reef. That's Give me beautiful. that one. I'm taking well, this one home. So this is the one that's making the babies. The electric that. blue Ali. That's what? Nice. Dude, there's some really Look nice fish in here. Oh, it's a giant goldfish too. Look at that size of that goldfish, you guys. Every net we're catching literally like just, just tens and yeah, tens of fish. Perfect. This will probably take us literally all day, guys. So we're gonna keep going. I mean, look at all the fish right here in the mud. Oh, hang on, hang on. Look at the size of this koi, bro. There's a big one right here. I got him. Oh, look at that. <laughs> 
Yo, is it good if the algae gets my eyes? For now. Oh, stood up, relax. Look how beautiful that koi is. Okay, we're gonna get them in the bucket. This is so crazy. This is literally the most insane video ever, guys. All right. How many fish do you think we got so far, Josh? Like 100? Oh, over 100. Over 100. It's been two minutes. Oh, Josh, I found another big koi. This one's nice, dude. Look at this. Look how beautiful. Dude, this one's really cool. Look at that, Josh. Oh, wow, yeah. <laughs> Josh was like, where did that come from? This is so crazy, guys. All right, another giant koi. Let's get them in the bucket. Dude, I'm seeing some really cool African cichlids, though. This is so cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice my God. Here. Dude, you just caught, like, eight koi in one net. I like that gold one. Since there is, like, eight other ponds, I'm sure there's, like, other types of fish in the other ones, right? So you had, like, you know, koi and cichlids in here. There could be catfish in the next one. There could be anything. So this is really cool. This is going to take all day. Oh my gosh. Oh, I only caught one. <laughs> Look at that. That is amazing. Josh didn't put koi this small in here, so these are literally babies that just bred in here. Oh, you're catching all the fish. Look at this. Bro, you gotta let me have some of these. These are beautiful. Wait, there's one right here. I'm gonna grab it with my hands, Josh. You ready for this? Grab it with your hands? I don't need a net. Let's see. Let me see this. Oh. No. There was like five right there, though. Five and you couldn't get one? <laughs> and you lost the one you had. What? I didn't lose anything. Wow, we are stirring them up right now. Look at this. There's probably like 50 right here, bro. All right, we're catching so many fish that we actually have to bring them to like a pond right now. I mean, look at all the koi we already have in this bucket. Oh, this dude. is insane. And then right here, we have all the cichlids. Awesome. Look at that. Okay, so we're going to get these guys in a little pond, and then we're going to come back here, try to catch out the rest of the, the fish, but I, I doubt we will. I mean, this is insane. It's going to be pretty crazy, but I mean, look how many we've missed. We're going to hit the locker room, guys. We're going <laughs> to, you know, narrow out a game plan. <laughs> I don't know. I keep coming up with like eight or ten. He he comes up with half a fish that he throws back. Right. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> so let's get the fish we've already saved into a pond and we're gonna come back and try to catch the rest. Here we go. Josh, hurry up, they're dying. They're dying. Okay, here we go. Here goes all the koi. Look at that. This is insane. I can't wait to see all the fish that we come out with, you know, at the end of the day. That's been five minutes. And right here we have all the cichlids. Check this out. Look at all the little babies. Now the babies one day will turn into these guys. The really beautiful blue ones. That is so cool, okay. There they go. Let's get back there, try to catch some more, and see what all we can save. Here we go. Look at this while Josh is goofing around. Look at all the koi right here. <laughs> oh, I at least caught one there. Oh, that's a pretty one though. So, I mean, that's cool. Oh no, oh no, Josh, Josh, Josh. Oh no. We need to get this one in a bucket ASAP. He was on his side, he was trapped in the mud. Look at that cichlid. Oh, I got a couple there. Oh, look at this one. This one is so cool. Oh my gosh. Who's the one vacuumed it? <laughs> Who's the one who Oh my, oh my God. Josh! We're trying to save him. I know, okay. I know. Oh, dude, this one's gorgeous. Come on, buddy. I got him, yes. Look at the colors on that one. Oh, right here, Josh, there's like four koi. Oh yeah, you got him, you got him. Oh, that one's like blue. Oh, that is so sick. Look at this guy, he's trapped in the mud. Got him. Oh, okay, Josh thinks he can do the BFP special and grab this koi with his hands. Look at that, look at that. What was that? You made me second guess myself. <laughs> oh. Right there. <laughs> you guys check this out. I'm dying, Josh is dying. This is a lot of work, but there's so many fish in here. I mean, look at all the ones we caught this time. Oh, that's it. Dude, this one's deformed. Look, see his little tails, he's got scoliosis. All right, guys, we got a bunch more koi. Look at this. There's literally every color of the rainbow here. We're going to bring them to the pond. And then, Josh, you have a whole area we're going to put these guys in quarantine, yeah. right? We're going to do that. And then we're going to come back. And I don't know. There's a lot more fish in here. But I kind of want to see what's in the other pond. So I might grab some fish traps, throw them in there, and see what's living in those guys. Here we go. The farm out there is a lot better than a fish trap. What was that? It's a lot better than a fish trap. Are you challenging me to, to a battle? I mean, All right. see what you can no, do. No, 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 I'm gonna grab some fish traps. I'm gonna throw them in a different pond that we haven't fished, and we're gonna see how many fish I catch. All okay, right. Josh? Deal. All right, let's go get them in their actual pond. Here yeah. we go. We're gonna dump them all in the net right here. Look at all the fish we've saved already out of the abandoned fish farm. This is the pond they're going in. Oh my gosh, we have so many fish. There they go, check it out. They're gonna be in here for a little bit. Make sure they don't have any diseases. But now, guys, Josh challenged me to a little fish trap challenge, okay? He doesn't think my fish traps are gonna catch any fish. I'm gonna go bait them up, get them in the ponds, and we're gonna see what we can catch. All right, guys, so I have two of my favorite fish traps. Now, there is, like I said, like eight or more ponds here, so I don't really know where to start, but the first one we walked up to right here has a ton of fish. I see like a bunch of cichlids, a bunch of little guys. We're gonna throw our traps in here. At the end of the day, we're gonna check them and see what we caught. Josh doesn't believe in me, but fish traps always work. So here we go. We're gonna place one in this corner. There it goes, right there. Oh, that is so perfect. 
All right, guys, we're here on the other side of the pond. These ponds are massive. In this end, I actually see a lot more fish, so I'm really excited. Let's just place our trap right there. Perfect. Now, guys, we're going to do some exploring. I'm going to grab a net, grab a cast net. We're going to walk down, see if we can see any fish, and see if we can catch them. Here we go. Okay, guys, now we've walked down all the ponds. Now, there's so many here, I really don't know where to start. But all of them are pretty filled up all the way, except for this one. This one, I can actually get in here and net around. So we're going to see what's living in this abandoned pond, guys. This is so insane. Let's get in there and see what we can catch. Here we go. Now, draw is not here right now but he did tell me there are snapping turtles everywhere back here so i'm gonna have to be a little careful here oh this is scary oh that is so disgusting i don't know if there's gonna be anything in this pond guys oh my gosh oh i see fish right here though you guys there was actually fish in here they look like little mollies maybe Ugh. oh we're in it now guys this is insane look at this oh wait we got a fish in here i just saw a fish i couldn't tell what it was oh oh my god i think it's an angel fish check this out Oh my God, it's massive. Look at the size of the angelfish. Okay, that is a new species out of the abandoned fish farm ponds. We haven't caught one yet today. So that is really cool. We got a little bucket. We're gonna fill it up and get this guy in it. Let's get back in there, guys. Clearly there's some really cool fish in here and hopefully we could catch them out. We've walked down a little bit, guys. I see a lot of little fish. I can't tell what they are. Oh my gosh, these plants are so thick back here. Who knows how long no one has been back here, you guys. And there's still fish back here. Oh God, look at this. Look how nasty this stuff is, you guys. This is so gross. <gasps> oh my gosh, look, look right here. There's a fish. Oh my God, he's coming out of the mud. No freaking, well. It's on my face, right? Oh my gosh. I think that's a little mite of cichlid. Oh my gosh, we gotta get him in the bucket right now. He is covered in mud and so am I. Here we go, guys. Second fish out of this abandoned fish farm pond. Look how beautiful that fish is. We got an angel fish and a Midas. Some really cool fish. So we're gonna get back in there, you guys. I'm actually seeing a lot of fish in this one. We might have to get Josh to come back here and drain this one. I mean, if you look down here, the fish farm just goes on forever. There's ponds everywhere you look. So who knows how many fish are back here in need saving, guys. This is gonna be crazy, but let's keep going. Nothing in there. Uh, oh my gosh. There's literally no telling what could be in here. Look at this. Oh, right here, right here. There's little fish. Oh my gosh, we actually caught stuff. Wait, those are more cichlids. Look at that, you guys. These are little African cichlids. You can't really tell. Let me wash them off. But these right here are African cichlids. Look at the colors on that one. That is so beautiful. New species we have discovered in this pond. There's cichlids in here as well. Let's see how many we can catch today. There's a lot in here. Here we go, another net. This is literally insane, guys. I've never seen any pond like this. I mean, look at the muck. This stuff is so nasty. Ugh. You guys, we're definitely gonna have to come back for a part two, because there's so many fish in here and it's so hard to catch them all out. But we're trying our best. <gasps> Fuck, fish right there. What is that? Oh my gosh, it's some sort of catfish. Oh my God, look at that. I think that's actually called a Lima shovel nose. That is so cool, you guys. That's a really big one too. All right, let's wash them off, get them in the bucket. Look at this. In five minutes out of this new pond, you guys, we got some crazy stuff. Look at that. Oh, this is so awesome. We're gonna give it a couple more nets. We're staring everything right now to the middle and it's getting really hard to catch them. So we're gonna try a little bit more and then I think we're gonna check our fish traps. Here we go. Ugh, let's scoop under all these plants. Oh, I saw a lot right there. Oh, <gasps> what the heck is that? Oh my gosh. Oh my, what is this? Oh my God, is that a lungfish, you guys? Look how massive that lungfish is. That was the last thing I was expecting. Look what we just caught. Oh my gosh, oh relax, buddy. No, no, no. Let's get them in there. We can't lose them, guys. This is crazy. That is the craziest fish we've caught yet today. That is a massive African lungfish. We're gonna get them in the bucket. There's so many crazy fish back here, guys. Let me know if you want a part two. Oh my gosh, I was not expecting to catch a lungfish. I can't believe it. Okay, let's go down to the fish traps. We're gonna check both of them right now, and hopefully we caught something crazy. All right, you guys, it is finally time to check our fish traps. They've been marrying here all day. We got two in this pond. I'm really excited. So we're gonna check this first one and see what we caught, guys. I see a lot of fish in here. I can't tell what they are. Wait, I can actually see a lot of fish. They're actually like surrounding the trap right now. I still can't tell what they are. They look like cichlids maybe. Here we go. Oh my gosh, there's so many fish. Oh my, oh my God. There's so many in here. Look at this. The freaking trap is jam packed. Look at that. There's so many colorful fish in there. Look at this. This guy wasn't even in all the way. It's a little cichlid. This is so insane, guys. We have so many fish in the trap. They look like cichlids. Some look like platies maybe or mollies. Let's get them out. Oh my God. Look at this. This one's beautiful. Oh my gosh. Well, Josh is in here, so it looks like I could take that one home. I've never seen this many fish. Look at this. I'm gonna take a whole handful right now. Look at all the fish that we got. So you can see right here, a lot are platies, a lot are African cichlids. I think we just gotta dump them all in. There's so many fish in here. Look at that. What is going on? And that was just the first trap, guys. We have two of these. Look at that. That's the most fish I've ever gotten a fish trap. Oh my gosh. 
that is freaking nuts, you guys. Okay. Well, we've discovered what kind of fish are in this one. There's a bunch of sigvas, a bunch of platies. Now we're gonna head to the end and check the second fish trap, guys. This was insane. Let's see what we got in the other one. All right, guys, we are here at the second fish trap. We got a brand new bucket. We're gonna fill it up here. I'm looking down at the trap and I actually see way more fish in this one than the first one. I don't know how that's possible, but I can actually see them swimming in the trap as we speak. So let's get some water in the bucket. I am so excited. Oh my gosh, there's literally, there's like hundreds of fish in there. Let's bring it in and see what we got, guys. Oh my gosh, look how much the freaking trap is sagging. This thing is loaded with fish. I think they're more cichlids, more platies, I think. These ponds are literally loaded with fish still. Imagine how many were in here when they were actually up and running. Look at the colors on that African cichlid. Look at that, we're just pulling them out left and right. Oh, there's crawfish in here too, check this out. There's actually crawfish. Look at that. Oh, that's so crazy. We'll throw him in the bucket, why not? So these are little Mabuna African cichlids right there. Oh my gosh, okay, more crawfish. We're just gonna dump everything in. Oh my God, I can't believe it, you guys. These ponds are literally loaded with fish. Just handfuls and handfuls of cichlids. I don't even know what Josh wants to do with these things. I'm gonna have to ask him. <gasps> Oh my God, wait, wait, out in the middle. There's a giant fish out there. I might have to go in. How deep is this water? Oh, I'm about to fall in. How deep is this water? Oh, it's not that deep. Okay, I can actually walk out here. Guys, I just saw a big fish out there. I'm gonna see if I can find it. I think it looked like a red tail maybe. Let's see if I can find this thing. He went this way. Oh my gosh, I'm murking it up right now, you guys. I had to cast whatever that was. I might have to get like a cast. <gasps> it's right down here. Wait, it's right down here. Look at that. It's a red tail. Hold on, where did it go? Oh no. I just saw a red tail catfish in here. It looked pretty big. Oh, it's right here. Look, look right here. Oh my gosh, come on, buddy. Please get in the net. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. This is not the right net for this. Come on. Oh no, 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 no. Look, he's coming right here. No, 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 no. Get in the net. No, that was so close. Oh my gosh, this thing is so smart. There he is. Oh my God. Okay, this is insane, you guys. I had no idea there was a red tail in here. You know what? We might have to just walk him here and wait for him to get in the shallow end. Screw the net. I'm going to grab him. I think I have to grab him. Look at this, you guys. Hey, buddy. Oh, he's quick. Come back. No! No, 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 no. Don't go that way. Come on, buddy. Nice and easy. We're trying to save you. No! No, 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 no. Is that it right there? Oh. Oh. No. Oh, my God. I just caught a turtle. Wait, what? That is not what we were looking for. Oh, my gosh. What kind of turtle was that? Have you seen the red tail catfish, buddy? Guys, we just spent about 30 minutes looking for this red tail catfish that we saw. And we were not successful. The pond is super murked up now. So, you know what that means. We definitely have to come back for a part two. Try to catch up this massive red tail catfish. If you want to see that, let me know. Go down there and leave a like. But for now, guys, we're going to bring all the fish that we saved today back to my house. Put them in my backyard tanks, backyard ponds, and give them a new life, guys. So, we will see you there. All right, guys we've made back to my house with all of the fish that we saved today from the abandoned fish farm that was by far one of the craziest fish rescues we've ever done i mean in an abandoned fish farm you just don't see that every day so me and josh are definitely going to be filming there a lot in the future expect more videos there comment down video suggestions but yeah guys there's like 15 more ponds there filled with fish so we got to go back and save the rest but for now guys we did bring some of the fish back and we're going to put them into my backyard ponds and my fish tanks here we go so the first fish we're going to be putting into one of my ponds is this lungfish that we caught right here. It's actually a pretty big one, but it's nowhere near the size of the other one that we have. And the other one is actually right down here. Oh, there he is. You can see him. Look at that. So this guy is the same fish as this guy. This one is just way bigger. Let's see if he's friendly today. Hey, big guy. Oh my God. Look at the size of that lungfish. Okay, buddy, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And I think it's a really good idea to actually put this guy in here with the other one, just to give him a little buddy. So we're gonna add this lungfish into the turtle pond. There he goes. Now, also in this pond is our massive Mata Mata turtle. He shouldn't mess with the lungfish. I mean, he hasn't messed with the big one. And we do have our albino soft shell, which is a little mean, but he likes to eat the smaller fish. So I think our lungfish are gonna be totally fine. Oh, there he goes. My gosh, lungfish are so cool. Oh, I love them. Guys, comment down below a new name for our lungfish. Look, here he comes. He's coming up for air. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. There he goes, look at that, sucking in some air. Such cool fish. And now he's got a buddy. Now guys, let's get the rest of the fish and find homes for them. While we're back here, I actually wanna give you an update on the predatory pond. Just real quick, because in a recent video, we added three monster albino placos in here to try and eat all the algae so we can see the fish easier. Look how easy it is to see our monster fish now. Look at everyone. That is literally insane, oh my gosh. It looks so much better, guys. I'm so happy that it worked. Placos, guys, who would've thought? If you got a bunch of algae in your pond, just throw a plate going there and you're good to go. So our next fish is this guy, the Midas Cichlid. He's actually really pretty. Check him out. We caught him in the back pond. That 
back palm was loaded. And we're actually gonna get this guy in the Oscar palm. We have some in here already, so he will fit perfectly in here. Let's get him in. There you go, buddy. Welcome to the pond. Oh, look at everyone checking them out. All right, next up we got this guy, the Lima Shovel Nose. Now these are some really cool catfish. They don't get as big as the Tiger Shovel Nose, but they're really pretty. So we're actually gonna get them into the front pond. Oh my gosh, he is feisty. There he goes. That's a really cool catfish. Not as cool as red tail catfish though. And um, there was one in the other pond. I watched back the footage. That was for sure a red tail catfish, guys. So I'm actually really excited. We have to go back and get them. Go down there and leave a like if you think so too. The rest of the fish that we brought back today, like the angelfish, all the cichlids, all the platies, we put into the quarantine pond. You can actually see all the cichlids. We caught a lot today. So yeah, guys, that was insane. Saving fish from an abandoned fish farm. If you did enjoy this one, please go down there and leave a like. Subscribe down below. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.